the height says nine feet. Can we fit under? Yep, we fit under. Good afternoon, everyone, from beautiful Meriwether County, Georgia. And look at that. Today's adventure brings us to what the map says, Red Oak Creek Covered Bridge, if you can see that clear enough. And this is a historic covered bridge. And let me go take you for a look. There is a weight limit of three tons, and this is actually the second covered bridge I've visited in Georgia. The first one being Watson Mill Bridge State Park in Comer, Georgia. And one of these days I'm going to take you for a look up that way. There's the history on it. It's the National Historic Place. It's on the Register of the Historic Places of Georgia. Georgia Historical Society. And that river looks so cool down there on a hot summer day. There may be some fish down that way. Let's go walk through the bridge. You can tell this is an older bridge because you can look down through the cracks and see the, see there? And I smell creosote and nails. And you can still drive through here. Now this is different than the one in Comer, Georgia. The difference is you can see down to the river. You see down there? And it smells like creosote, but the one in Comer, Georgia had windows that would open on the side and it was really pretty. Built in the 1800s. The boards creak when you walk, and it's kind of dark in here. The one in Comer, Georgia, they used to have dances in. Maybe this one used to have dances and parties, too. I love that old smell, that old wooden creosote smell. It smells great. This is the other part of the covered bridge that comes outward. And there's the river down there. Oh look, an old TV that washed up. Looks like one of those tube TVs down there. The water talks, if you notice. I don't know what caused that. I think that's an intake pipe. How about that? But there's an old shell of a TV, at least, down there. Wow. And an intake pipe. This is like a park area because they have picnic tables set up down there. And all the way down there, there's the other entryway to the bridge. Let's walk back through this covered bridge here in Meriwether County, Georgia. And we're going to hurry up and walk through this. It's okay. I love the rafters. I mean, it just so reminds me of the other Watson Mill Bridge. It's so pretty. So, I'm thinking we're going to try to drive across it. No. We're not going to drive across it. Okay. So, we're just going to take pictures of it and let it be pretty. What does this sign up here say? 
High water mark, July 7th, 1994. Interesting. Well, that is something. I guess it flooded really bad over here. Huh. And then there's all kinds of writings on the wall where people have been here. Wow. The beautiful covered bridge. I smell creosote and wood on a hot summer day. And there's a car coming, so I'm going to get out of the way. Red Oak Creek Covered Bridge in Merriweather County, Georgia. You can come out here and have a, a nice picnic. I don't know if you can fish or not, but there may be fish down there. That'd be a great place to row a canoe if it's warm enough. That's a beautiful bridge, beautiful covered bridge. Ah, I love it. This is so beautiful down here and cool in the summer. Red Oak Creek. You can see that intake pipe way down there. And if you've enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And very pretty. And I see some whirlpools down there too. Don't forget to subscribe. And thank you so much for watching.